ask around in Cool Valley. And you'll find they're not afraid of new ideas. Look, it's new digital money or digital gold. Mayor Jason Stewart says he has a plan to put that digital gold in the hands of every Cool Valley resident. I would like to see every single household in my city receive some level of Bitcoin, whether it be $500, $1,000. So what is Bitcoin? Think of it like regular money, but it's not issued by any country or impacted by traditional inflation. You don't need a bank to use it. It's completely online. And some say if its value keeps going up, it could one day become the world's currency. Recently, El Salvador became the first country in the world to make Bitcoin its legal currency, a move made to protect its economy from inflation. In Cool Valley, Mayor Stewart thinks it could be transformational. I have friends whose lives have been completely changed, like going from working a regular nine to five job to being worth over $80 million in a matter of a few years. Where's the money gonna come from? I have some very supportive donors who have agreed to match any money that I raise up to several millions of dollars. You have people that are starving, unemployed, unhoused. What do you say to people who think this money would be better spent meeting those basic needs? I feel that fundamentally, this is the best way to meet those basic needs is to get Bitcoin into the hands of people who can use it the most. The idea is that maybe you don't touch it for five years before you really get full access to it. My number one concern is that someone just sells their Bitcoin to pay their car note. And then when Bitcoin's sitting at like $500,000 all these years later, they're going to really regret that. Roughly 1,500 people live in Cool Valley. The dozen or so we spoke with seemed receptive to the idea. That's the first time I heard of that. And you think it's a good idea? I think so, and he's putting money in my pocket. I believe that Cool Valley is going to get wealthier and wealthier, not just our city, but the actual people who live here. Details about how the Bitcoin will be distributed are still unclear, but the mayor says he hopes to get it to residents by the end of the year. He says he'll also offer classes so people know how to securely store the digital currency. For the I-Team, PJ Randawa, Five on Your Side.